I've been busy. I got real busy. I mean, trying to get my business up and going. I mean, I got my own fragrance line coming out that you need to check that out. Uh, got beard care products. Need to give that a look-see. I mean, I've been real busy. So all you have to do, go onto my website, www.madeupmonkeyshit.com because that's all a lie. Uh, life got in the way, but I'm back and I'm here for it. What up, what up? Hey, good to see y'all. Been away for a while, glad to be back. And when I come back into it, I want to come back with a winner. And this fragrance I've been sitting on for a few months now. Uh, we went to a fragrance convention uh, put together by City Rhythm and the owner Niles. And yeah, I wonder, oh, that was March. Jesus, has it been that long? Yeah. And uh, so picked this fragrance up sometime after that when it first came out. And honestly, I was blown away. I really was blown away. And on that note, City Rhythm is maybe one of the few houses, if not the only one, that I like everything they've offered. Every offering I actually like. Uh, from Miami, New Orleans, Austin, San Diego, Manhattan, damn near in that order. But I like everything. And this new one, St. John, is at the top. This one jumps straight to the top based on the idea of it executes the note of quince hmm. which I don't think I've had any other fragrance that featured that note so I was already intrigued and the story behind it was just wonderful well uh, you can look on maybe his Instagram page and you might be able to get it but it's, it's dealing with his father and passing and coming back to him in a, in a dream and with that particular note and he decided to utilize it and it just was an instant winner some of the other notes that are in it at the base, you got uh, ambergris, sandalwood, rum. The middle notes, I remember lavenders in there, if I'm not mistaken. And at the top, it was guava, of course, quince, and uh, lime, coconut. No lime in the coconut jokes. We're not going to do that. But the quince is along the lines of an apple pear kind of scent. And in this fragrance, it absolutely works. And it's, it lasts all day long first to start with. And before you jump and say lime, coconut, uh, no, not virgin olive water, not even close, not even in the same ballpark, it ain't even the same sport, like Sam Jackson would say, minus the words. But it is a unique fragrance, fruity, smooth base, slight floral, but mainly the fruit stands up and out and makes it per perfect for the heat. Of course, it's been like 106 around here in San Antonio, but been perfect for the, the hot weather. And this, I'm pretty sure has a strength that it's gonna punch through in the winter and fall. It is that, has that concentration where it's gonna last. And to me, they all do. They all last as long as the day goes. And honestly, I gotta, I gotta pick up more. I love the look of the bottles. I love the the shimmer that's in it. The sprayer, nice. Can't miss, I almost sprayed the whole camera. But you, it's just, I love this line. And I'm looking for more from the line. I gotta pick up more from the line. But, uh, wow, that smells nice. Uh, yeah, it's just, this is all that. But uh, all in all, I just want to come back you know, give a review, say, hey, I need to get back in the rhythm of things. Glad to be back in front of the camera. Feeling rusty as hell, rusty old dog. But hey, life is getting in the way, you know. But um, all in all, I wanna be back and talking about these fragrances. I've been picking up quite a few. And down the pipeline here, I really wanna do an updated uh, top 10 Mancera. That's to be done. And uh, some of the others that I've just picked up throughout, you know, my time. And one that I was kind of disappointed in, and I'll get to that. It, it was a fragrance I was so excited about. 
and it just fell flat on his face. It started great and just kerplat, and it just went down. But down the road, we'll get there. I got so much I need to talk about, so many things I need to get to. Uh, some uh, some beard care products as well. Oh man, um, my plate is full. But hey, we'll get there. Hey, it's great seeing y'all. All in all, I'm back. I'm well. I'm healthy, and uh, look forward to talking to y'all soon. Have a wonderful day, and take care.